I'm Dan Maltz. I'm a chemist with the Cleveland Water Department. Turbidity is the degree to which water loses its transparency due to suspended particles. If you have a higher degree of suspended solids or air in the water, it'll have a higher turbidity and it'll look more murky. This is a raw water sample at 8 NTU. This is a finished water sample at less than 0.1 NTU. We measure turbidity throughout the treatment process to make sure the water goes from here and gets to here. Out in the lake we have sondes which measure the Lake Erie water. As the water comes into the plant we have surface scatter 7 turbidimeters which are high range turbidimeters and that'll measure the raw water as it comes in through the pumps. Once it's in the plant we have various turbidimeters and density probes that measure it. To have good taste and odor in finished water we have to have a low turbidity. Also low turbidity will prevent disinfection byproducts, bacteria, and pathogens. Throughout the year we'll have slight fluctuations. Uh, sometimes the lake will turn over and that'll be a point in the year that we'll have a high fluctuation. It'll increase dramatically. And then after storms we'll have a large increase in turbidity. To compensate for that we usually increase our aluminum sulfate, our alum dosage, or we'll add a catatonic polymer, our cat flock, which is a filter aid.